Cecilia's escape, I was a blind by Roxanne Harris, Bonginda Daba's Miracle, and Bandlela Uye and Koli are some of the films that will be screened at the Women in Film Dialogue currently underway at the Soweto Theatre. The celebration of Women in Film kicked off with a panel discussion about some of the challenges facing female filmmakers in the country. Founder of the Women in Film Dialogue, Linda Genya, joins us in studio to tell us more about the gathering. Linda, it's great to have you on Morning Live. I was expecting one of the ladies. Could they simply not wake up this morning? Well, they're supposed to actually <laughs> do to do the interview, but yeah. unfortunately they couldn't make it, and we confirmed stuff late. So ah, I since see. Since I'm the event organizer, I just thought, hey, why not come do the interview? Brilliant. Uh, won't you please give us background into the idea of women in film and how it came about? So the women in film dialogue uh, is actually came about with NFVF and uh, Linda Kenya. So NFVF every year they usually fund about seven women. Uh, to screen films and they do have a panel of discussions as well to discuss all the nitty gritties that we have mm. in the industry you know and we just decided hey man why not we take the women in film dialogue to Elokshin you know and have a two-day screening at Soweto Theatre which is we screen the content that is on the screen so yesterday we have we screened about seven movies and today we're screening seven more movies as well mm. so yeah. I mean, this is a two-day event and it is now in its fourth installment. Yeah. Um, won't you take us through just in your opinion how it's grown and um, also just in the quality of the work that is shown and the enthusiasm for the ladies, is the passion growing or, you know, what are some of the things that you have picked up? The passion has grown because remember back in the days we had less female writers yeah. and female producers and directors. So NFVF just thought, hey man, why not just uh, unlock females and get them to tell stories that people Basilokshin would relate to about people of South Africa. So I thought, hey man, why not just give them a platform where we just invite people to come screen the content. And uh, most of the movies, actually seven of the movies that uh, were screened at Soweto Theatre yesterday and today, they're not out yet. You know, so if you can come to the Soweto Theatre, you exclusively catch mm. the content. Um, but Linda, what are some of the issues that, that women raise just generally in, in the world of film about the current state of the film industry in this country. I know that the industry has opened up slightly to women and uh -huh. has become very inclusive. We see more and more uh, women film directors, the likes of Mabato Monsu, really doing amazing stuff yeah. in that space. But uh, what are some of the challenges uh, that you know maybe women have uh, raised with you in conversation or that have come up in these dialogues? Look, most of them has, has to be definitely discrimination and lack of funding. You know, so that's why the NFVF came into play to say, ladies, we can actually assist you guys with all the challenges that you guys are encountering. Mm. You know, I know yesterday one lady, Amber, um, she had a situation where she, she needed funding to do her film, you know, and she just decided, hey, look, why don't I give NFVF a try? Mm. And NFVF assisted from the production, from the development phase of it up until the final product, mm. you know, so, but I think majority of the problems that we face is women need funding. Mm. And what else came up in the dialogue that took place yesterday? Uh, look, yesterday I had to direct an, an promotional video. Yeah. <laughs> so I only managed to catch what Amber had to share. Yeah. You know, but I know most of them, they do have challenges in the industry, you know, because mm. being a woman is not easy. Mm. You know, you always looked at Guti, you're a woman, are you going to do it? Are you capable of it? You know, but I'm so glad that NFVF came into play and so it took theaters as well came into play. They were like, look, let's give these women a platform where they can come screen their content, mm. you know, have a Q&A session, get to understand what the people are all about, what kind of content we need, mm. you know, because for the longest of time, we've always uh, inspired by American story writers. And finally, we're doing it, Imzant, you know, we're telling our stories by our local women. Mm. And Linda, how, how, in your opinion, how important is it to continue to uplift women in this space and to bring them into the fold and uh, to trust them more and to give them uh, the same amount of money? Um, why is that important? Why is women's contribution important? Look, we're equally, you know, in honesty, we're all equal. And to be frank, I mean, you might have a great story more than I, mm. you know, and you might happen to be the best director and I, I happen to be the best scriptwriter, you know, so I think we shouldn't look at women can't do this, women can't do that. I think it's high time we actually collaborate with women because yeah. all the movies that were screened yesterday, people enjoyed them. We're screening them again today and it's for free. You can come catch breakfast. We'll provide breakfast. Uh, we're having three screenings and then we're going to have lunch and then we have four more screenings. All right. And so. who, are, who are these films by today that we can expect to see? So, um, 
Some of the female makers, I haven't met them, mm -hmm. but yesterday I got to meet Emba and I got to meet Sarah and just a couple of female makers. Yeah. But some of them are coming today because some of them came yesterday and some of them will be available today. All right, Linda, that's where we'll leave it. Thank you so much. Thank you. I, I see every time you speak about the women, you've got the smile on your face. I, I, I think you really do believe <laughs> <laughs> that women do deserve to be on an equal footing and that there should be equity in this space. Thank you so much for your role. I mean, thank you guys for having me. And uh, if you guys are available today, please do, do join us at Sweet with the I, I, I want breakfast. You should have brought me breakfast first. But Well, breakfast <laughs> is on me after this. <laughs> it's okay. That's Linda Guinho is the founder of the Women in Film Dialogue, which came to at the Soweto Theatre yesterday and continues today. It will showcase local movies produced and directed by women in South Africa.